Okay, Memorial Day weekend, the unofficial start to summer. We're talking about going to the lakes, and next week, I said, is June. So we need to start packing for lake weather and heading to the cabin. We have Ashi Berg here, our fashion expert, to talk a little bit about what's hot right now, some great ideas for what you should pack to go to be versatile. Welcome so much today. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, yeah, I so wanted to give us some easy, good options so that whether we're staying in town this weekend or, like you said, for future weekends going to the lake or this weekend, um, we can just mix and match and easily look great and not have to take too much with not us. Not take too much, okay. Right. So I, Lisa, went over to Macy's and found all these great items. Um, the first one I want to talk about is swimsuits, and I know on our last... We talked time, a lot about suits last time, yeah. Right, and so of course you're going to want to take a suit. I thought this one was really great because it is all about stripes. Love Rainbow stripes. stripes is a big trend. And how fun and back. bright and pretty is that? And what you could do, Lisa, is take this little Free People um, tie-dye shirt and just put it right over... Oh, so you kind of see it underneath yeah. a little bit? Yes, exactly. So you could just have that combined together, the two, and then throw on just a little slide. So you kind of got this whole look put together. You could either do the slide or the sneaker, and you're set. I love it. Yeah. Can you wear the cover-up with, like you can wear it without pants or anything, just over your sewing suit. Could you put on shorts with that cover-up or cover-ups, well, just cover-ups? It's, it's great you said that because then I would move on to the shorts. Sometimes when shirts are that long, you don't want to tuck it in be with a short because it's too much, Okay. right? Yeah, right. It's all blu bu um, just bulky and then you can't see it over the shorts anyways. But you could take your shorts, of course, and wear it with the bikini top, right? Cute. Yes, cute. I like that look. And of course, we've got the Panama hat. How cute is that? You could... Um, if you want to give, give me that one there, Lisa, I can oh, yeah. show them how we can just uh, sort of combine it all. Just kind of... Ooh, you would look so chic. Right? And then for the shorts, I love this top here, this desert tone, um, that rust color we've been talking mm -hmm. about, all those great neutrals. You could combine it with the shorts and then even just add a little cute belt. Um, I thought this belt was great. It's Ralph Lauren. And here, I'm going to have you, if you don't mind, to mm -hmm. hold that up. And then you've got just this whole cute look. Throw on a pair of slides um, or just a little sandal, anything. It's just easy it. and quick. This, or the little This is the color ones. you told me you think I should get for a, a swimming suit. Definitely. It's such a big color. Really, pro really pretty. Yeah, this is a very so pretty feminine top, too. Definitely. Can I ask a quick question about the shorts? So my mom just asked me with jeans, and I think this applies. The, the distressed and the holes, that's still in. That's still in, definitely, okay. for you know, sure. So you just, you, you don't know. I, that's why we have you come on. Just make sure that we're still in fashion. Definitely. And then also, too. Oh, these are <clears> huge. These are huge right everywhere now. on Instagram and definitely. social. Definitely. It's all about macrame and how perfect, like, for the lake or the beach, anywhere, I really, love it. for summer. And just the colors just combine, I think, so pretty. How love pretty it. together. Beautiful. Yes. And they come in all different sizes. I mean, this is a great size, big enough for like a wallet and a purse, but big, small. Definitely. All different sizes. Um, and then, too, you could, Lisa, do a whole little, just a combination of, of beautiful chains. This one's beaded, which is really big. And if you just pack one set of jewelry, you can really mix it with everything. So I love doing hoops with a look like this and even just a little bracelet. And you can just combine it, whether it's with the top, um, anything. So it kind of dresses it up. But you have the jewelry with if you want to go a little bit more. And then if you want to dress it down a little bit, you don't have as many pieces on, too, it seems. Definitely. Yeah. Okay. Easy. And How then about the sweater? Right? That blushy nude pink. Again, all about the neutrals. If you're cold at night and you just want to throw it on with your shorts, just make it easy and, and put it on with a little slip-on. You need the layering pieces because it's still not hot. Exactly. So if Cute. we layer up, we're in good shape. And then it's all about white, of course. Um, well, now, because we can wear white after Memorial Day, but not after Labor Day. No, I'm just kidding. That rule doesn't apply anymore. Right? Yeah, that's kind of an outdated rule. I know that it's been around for a long time, but we don't want to stick to the old rules. We'll just wear white and feel chic and not worry about it. And Lisa, we could combine it with the beautiful white top and just do like a whole white oh. look. Like that, you could do it with the tote. Kim and Kanye would approve of that outfit. All white. Exactly. 
right? Okay, and we also have, yeah. I want to talk about the red. Yeah, if you could Close. hold that one up, that would be That's awesome. Pretty. This one is actually a dress. Oh, it's a dress. So if you're, you want to just have a pretty dress on at night, I think this is perfect. You can dress it up or dress it down by putting it with a, a sandal. So cute. Or you could even do it with your sneaker, right? And then just throw on a denim jacket and you're good to go. Again, all about the layers, I think. The denim jacket, once again, still a staple. Yes, for sure. Great stuff. And you know what? I, how many outfits will we get out of this? Quite a few. And I, I know I could fit this few. all in one, like, large duffel, I for sure. I think so. And then if you just want to, I love these wedges, too. How cute are those? I love them. If you just want to make anything look fun with that. I love that, a wedge. And the wedge, you know, looks good on your calves, so. Yes. <laughs> Gotta make our legs look good. It's right? all about the legs when yeah. we're out there. Aji, thank you so much. Great ideas as we uh, move into uh, summer lake season. Stay with us. Coming up next, you know what else we like to do in the summer? Head to the farmer's market. We're going to be talking with Robert Bread Smith next about some great finds this time of the year.